Hello and welcome to a new series of yet another history programme. And I'm Dr Simon Sharma. This week we look at the reign of Henry VIII, the Tudor monarch who gambled his kingship, upset the status quo and sliced the church in two. <laughs> The BBC would like to point out that because of the massive fee paid to Dr Simon Sharma, it has only been possible to use three illustrative props for this programme. We hope this does not mar your enjoyment. In 1529, the king felt isolated. <laughs> Except for the woman who had given him no heirs, there was a chance that the marriage could split. <laughs> but he could restore balance by making Anne Boleyn his queen. The various options had to be weighed. Should he put his cards on the table, or should he wait? Henry disliked Rome and didn't want to build bridges. Instead, he decided to upset the equilibrium, to have his cake and eat it too. Ignoring the advice of card in the Woolsey, Henry broke off ties with Rome, established the Church of England and began the dissolution of the monasteries. All hell broke loose. <laughs> and then Thomas More, Hampton Court, etc, etc, the end. I'm off to count my money now, but I'll be back next week when I'll do the whole Renaissance with nothing but a compass, a pipe and a potato. <laughs>